Hi everyone, this is Austin from Robles, and today is day seven of Grape Island. <clears throat> Sorry, I haven't posted a video in a few days. Um, I've just been eating really lightly and um, working a lot, so I haven't had much time to make a video. Um, I've pretty much just been eating three bags of grapes a day which is like two to three pounds each bag, um, closer to, closer to two. Um, so that's all I've really been doing. And, um, uh, haven't been juicing at all, really. Just like eating the grapes, because pretty much I'm lazy. And it's like the best way to consume the grape. You get like a crunch. You know, it's the way it's supposed to be eaten, consumed. So I try just to juice very occasionally, very rarely. Um, so yeah, it's about 11.30 right now. I just got out of the shower, as you can tell, probably. Um, I woke up this morning, I did like a kind of a sauna thing in my bathroom. I just, <clears throat> you know, turn the water on real hot, got it all steamy, and then um, open some tea tree oil and like put that in the water so like the steam would be like tea tree, you know, and it's kind of cleansing, like, and like it's really good to inhale that. Clears out your lungs. So I did that, and then I did some dry brushing you know, after your pores are all opened up, you want to do some dry brushing, get the dead skin off, and then I did a hot cold shower, starting hot and then ending cold. I always feel amazing. Every time I do that, it just makes me feel so good, energized in the morning. So. I like to practice it. I'm not sure how many bags of grapes I have left, but... Hmm. Oh, I did have... Um... A bag of Concord grapes uh, a couple days yesterday and the day before that. <clears throat> Posted that on my Instagram. Those are amazing. That was about two pounds. Um, I just get those occasionally because they're really expensive and they don't come into the store very often at all. They sell out almost immediately. But. Could buy a case, but they're like four dollars a pound compared to like the three dollars a pound that the globe grapes are. So you get a lot more of the globe grapes for a better price. I might get some of the Concord grapes um, from the Asian store actually because they have like a, a pretty large box for like twelve dollars. Um, so yeah, if you guys couldn't tell. I'm going to keep going on Grape Island um, as long as I can. I have, I still have tons of grapes. At least, at least 10 bags, if not more. So, I'm going to try for another week. And we'll see how it treats me. I am, um, 
I'm kind of surprised, actually, because I thought it'd be urinating more frequently. Um, but actually, I'm having movements more frequently. Sorry if that's too much information, but it's just true. It's just the seeds, I'm guessing. They're just cleaning me out, but... Not a bad thing to be clean. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like grapes are like the perfect food because when I did Watermelon Island, I was just frequently going to the bathroom, just peeing nonstop. And <coughs> that's because watermelon's like, 91 92 percent water and grapes are like 82 percent water now that's a lot closer to the human um the human like ratio of water you know the human level of water in our body so i definitely feel like grapes are a, a better food for us than than watermelon I mean, not saying there's better, better foods, but more ideal in terms of like eating what we are, like we are what we eat. So why not eat what like, high water foods? Because we are water. Very important not to dehydrate your water too much. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's probably about like a two pound bag of grapes. And a lot of these in here I can't eat. Not a lot, but they like 10 of them. Can't really eat. They got holes in them, moldy. No thanks. But these grapes are actually still really plump. I'm surprised. After seven days of being in the fridge, you know, I had my fridge at 40 degrees. You know, I'm sure that's fine for grapes, but there's still a lot of juicy plump ones in there, you know? Most of them are, actually. Hmm. So yeah, I'm pretty full. That's kind of a big breakfast, honestly. Especially since it's pretty early for me to be eating. Breaking my dry fast. Let's see. Stopped eating at 8 yesterday. That'd be... Like a 14... <clears throat> oh no, 15 hour dry fast. That's pretty good. So yeah, guys, I'm just still eating grapes, usually three, two to four bags a day, three, four bags, you know, and I love it, they're so filling, so satiating. And the red grapes feed your root chakra, which I really need to work on. <laughs> I know a lot of us do, so. Eat those colors. Get the red. Get the whole spectrum in you. But thank you guys so much for watching. <clears throat> um, thank you for following me again on Grape Island. This is the first week. It's been amazing. And, oh yeah. Yeah. 
I wanted to add that I lost um, eight pounds already. So I'm down to 142 now. I was at 150. So yeah, it's something big because I gotta lose this um, serpent that's inside of me, you know? So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, make sure to eat raw and stay blissful. And I hope you guys have a great day.